Today's reading is Cyclops, an entry from the Monster Encyclopedia book series. Monsters that quietly live deep within mountains and have an odd appearance with blue skin and a single eye. As they're called X-Giant Family and X-Giant Type, they were originally giants to begin with, but due to the influence of the current Demon Lord, they've changed to about the same size as a human so that it would be convenient to have sex with human men. It is said that they were originally members of divinities, but due to some gods that were disgusted by their single eye, they were banished from divinities, and they've since changed into monsters. For that reason, they have extremely great strength, and the Demon Lord's power was only partly effective. Their single eye trait has remained quite prominent. Since most individuals have comparatively docile personalities, hardly talk, and barely show changes in emotion, it's basically very hard to tell what they're thinking about. They normally live deep in the mountains and work as blacksmiths. Occasionally, they distribute the weapons that they produce to marketplaces through monsters and others that intermingle with humans. Their talent is considerable, so many warriors and heroes visit their dwellings to have weapons made after hearing rumors of them. They don't try to get involved with humans unless it's for work, which is rare for a monster. And even if they see a human man, they almost never attack. According to one explanation, it may be that... They feel inferior for having a single eye because of their his personal history. However, even they need to produce offspring, so sometimes they appear near human settlements and ask human men on the road, In exchange for a sword I made, I want you to spend a single night with me for the purpose of procreation. How very straightforward of her. After that, by the time the man wakes up the next morning, the Cyclops will be gone and only the weapon promised will be left behind. As mentioned before, these are extremely excellent weapons, and most of those who obtain their weapons become noted for their great valor. Just as they are skilled at handling weapons, they are also skilled at handling a penis, which can be said to be a man's weapon. Heh. <laughs> Since those who obtain their weapons are charmed by the pleasure given by their superior techniques, as well as their devoted and wholesome attitudes, they often disappear somewhere after making a name for themselves. The men who disappeared are probably now living happily with them deep in the mountains.